So family, welcome back to another uh, video. This one's actually going to be a reaction video to uh, another skater. He's on YouTube right now. I want you guys to go check out his channel down in the description. Seems like a really, really nice kid and everything. And today I want to react to him because this video is stating that he needs some help with his kick flips and everything because he keeps breaking boards. But anyways, let's get right into it. Um, hi. I have, like, these boards, um, that I broke, like, because I have this problem that's, like, when I kickflip, I'm, like, landing far behind too much, so, and I'm landing hard, because I'm jumping down, like, I'm jumping up, and then, like, I'm landing weird, so. So, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. It's been a while since I've been on a trick board, and it's been a while since I've been on a half pipe and everything. But uh, doing a kickflip, that's something that I really can never forget. I say that now, but just watch. I've, But I, I have broken a few boards doing kickflips like that. And I was taught that the reason that I kept breaking my boards is because I'm not aiming my back foot, the one that goes on the back of my board, far enough ahead from my other foot that I kept on landing on the tail of it and the tail weighs down the trucks, and that's what's making your board snap. See, I, I've broken my boards just like you. Um, so, what well, my guess is you're having the same issue I had, and you got to bring that back foot up along with the foot that you flip your board. I'm going to show you like this, because this is like, this is weird. Okay, so here's my boards. Um, I'm gonna just like pull these out each individually. So like I have this one. That one's kind of cracked. I cracked it in the same place. This one, not so much. These two, this was like my early board, and here is my first ever board. This one right here was my first ever skateboard I've ever used. So like that I'll just put those to the side. But here's the problem with my current boards. So this one I didn't get look 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 at this crap. <laughs> okay, so this one I didn't get too far back and boom. I snapped it right here. Even though it usually snaps in the middle, but I like how I did it so it, I can take away the no. Like just parking. But it also has this guy can't kick flip me through that. It's kinda ironic that you had a... Uh... This guy can't kick flip on your board. Was that okay? Let me know down in the comments if you ever watched this. Was it? Did, did you put the this guy can't kick flip before or after you snapped it? Kick flipping. And then the same exact thing with this board. The same problem. I'm like I said before. You might have the same problem that I did. Uh, like I said, when you kick flip, you have to bring up both feet, not just one. You have to bring up both. That way, when you land, you don't land too far back on your tail that it just snaps at the truck. Landing, like, my kick flips, I'm, I don't know what's going on, but this keeps happening. So, I'm like, okay, well, it won't happen again, right? <laughs> no, it did. So, but th except, except this one, it didn't break all the way through. This was my 8-inch. I like... Eight inches. I have like this sticker is like from some band, like local band, and then like got some other things on there. But like this is my eight. This was an eight point five. I'm never ever skating that ever again. I'm not really a big fan of eight point fives, but you know. And this is an eight two five. This was my favorite so far. An eight two five. This was perfect, but sadly it did kind of just snap. I don't even know who's pro 
deck this is. I don't, I'm, got some really good, like, slides, though. I need to drink some water or something. Okay, um, so, I got all these, and you know, I think the same thing happened to this one. I heard it crack, but nothing has happened. I mean, obviously, this is, like, that's the way how it should be. I ride regular, so... You know, it, that's just, you know, the way it is. There's the razor tail from the pops and stuff. I do a lot of popping in my skateboarding. And at the moment, I'm skateboarding. Oh, God, I gotta, okay. Where, I don't even know where it went. Give me a second. This is the, this is my current board right here. Let me just turn it around. Here we go. This one right here is a 775. Um... I told myself I'll never skate a 775 ever again. And I'm using tensor trucks with, what are these? 54 millimeters right here. And there's red bearings. These are really good for some reason. I don't know why. Um, 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 um and what else? I, I like tensors because they're, number one, they're lightweight. So like the, I mean, the board is still kind of heavy, but they're lightweight. And, and two, um... They're made by, like, Ronnie Mullen, you know? <laughs> like, Ronnie Mullen's little truck, so, you know, of course. Really good skater, so. Okay, I am going to give you a little tip on the uh, red bearings. The red bearings are good. They are made really, like, perfection. But the only problem is, is if you ever go to oil them up or grease them, they will corrode and stop your wheel from spinning instantly, like, within a day. It won't even give you a few days. I've talked about it in a, in my last video that bearings, depending on the type of oil you use, like I use I use oil for my bearings that are specifically made for skateboarding. But with the red bearings, even if you use the skateboard oil, they will corrode. I have no clue why, but they will. What in the what is that? Okay, so, I mean, this kind of held up. I just started committing. I, th I guess it didn't do this crack right here because uh, this is the top of the board right here. So, I mean, that's no crack. No kidding. What am I saying? So, it, I think it assumed it cracked right there because all my pressure to go right there, which sucks. It really sucks, but I've been committing a lot more and leaning forward. So, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm back. Okay, hold up. Okay, so, okay, as I was saying, that was my, um, oh my god, oh, I saw something. This, yeah, that's that's my problem right there. I'll make sure it looks nice. I'm just kidding, it doesn't matter, because, you know, they're broken. It sucks, but, you know. This no parking board was, like, my signature board. This was, like, my, the one I, I absolutely loved until, oh, there it is, right here. Oh, you can't see that. Now you can. Right, right here. That's where it kind of cracked. I don't... I was like, okay, well, I can just take off. Because the only thing I don't skate this is because of this grip tape. And I was like, okay, I'll just... I'll take it off. But I'm like, well, if I replace it, grip tape's like 10 bucks. This is going to snap in like 30 minutes. So, like, what's the point of fixing it? And my God, but what's the point of having it if it's completely fine? You know? I mean, there's no cracks, like, in the back. Also, if you crack your board, depending on where you crack it, if you crack it near the trucks, don't replace the grip tape. It's pointless. That thing's going to snap within a matter of a week or so. If you skate as often as I normally do nowadays, uh... Not gonna lie, after my son was born, I stopped skating for the longest time, and I'm just now getting back into it. So, but what I do know is I've cracked many boards, I've broken many boards, and if you crack a board, depending on where you crack it, if it's down the middle or near the trucks, dear God, there's um, no point in replacing your grip tape, because that thing's gonna break within a week. So, and it doesn't even have bad razor tail. I mean, that's pretty bad, actually. Never mind. 
but I guess I don't know, you know. <laughs> but these boards right here, these is I don't know what happened to this one. I'll be honest, I just don't remember. There's just a lot of things that you know happen. I think I got mad and snapped it, and I think I did the same thing with this one right here, right with this supreme or superior board. I get those confused. <laughs> it says it right there. I really like. I want to find a bigger one of this one. If I can get like an eight two five of this. I I'd love that, but I don't, so I don't have one. That's fine, I guess. I guess I'll just never have one, you know? What's on the bottom of this? Oh, yeah, and this thing is heavy. I've, like, look look how much boards I've skated in my life. And the same goes with trucks, but I'll make do trucks another video, because, you know. <laughs> but, yeah. Okay, so that's my problem, and I just need some help, like kick flipping better maybe i'll throw up some videos and maybe you can like judge them i mean in some of my videos i do it like really perfectly but some days i just they're horrible like and i obviously don't i don't know if i have any videos of some of those bad kick flips but i could check you know i could look for them i hope i do oh my i look horrible in this camera but you know it's gonna have to do i have to make this video out so yeah you know just judge this judge these videos Okay, yeah, that, that was enough right there. Um, <laughs> uh, you're throwing your foot back way too far. Like, hold on. Honestly, sadly, I don't have any trick boards at the moment. I just have the long board. I don't know what happened to all my trick boards, honestly. I think they, uh, I think I may have left them of a few places that I stayed at, uh, while I was homeless and they just took them in for themselves. So right now all I have is this long board. But say say this is a trick board, okay? And not a cruiser. When you kick flip and you go to throw it up like this. Crap, it's been a while since I've done this. And you slide your foot up a little bit, as if you're doing an ollie. Of course you are. And then you kick the you kick the board. Oh man, I just lost my balance right there. You don't want your foot, when you land, to land on the tail. You want it to land somewhere right here. Because otherwise, you land right here, it's going to snap in half. You land it on the tail, it's going to break the board like you've been doing. So you want it to land right here. Right where the trucks are. That way there's no possibility in hell that you break your board. So 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 yeah. <laughs> uh but anyways, um let me know if this video helped you at all. I really hope that you watch it. And you guys go subscribe to his channel, show him some love, hit that notification bell for him. Um, I'm going to throw up some clips of him skating right here, doing his kickflip. And I love you all so much. Subscribe, hit that notification bell, and like I said, go check his channel down. <laughs> go check his channel out. <laughs> show him some EXO family love, and subscribe, hit that notification bell. I'm burping a lot. And I love you all so much. I'll see you guys in the next Exo Family video tomorrow. Laters.